guys, welcome to today's video. Today, I'm just headed down to the barn. I'm a little bit late, dogs are ready to go. Uh, I just wanted to show you something really quick. One of our chickens died and we loved her. We knew she was old and we loved her for the beauty of her anyway. And the day that she died, we came inside and I sat down to edit the video and I looked at my computer and this was my screenshot, you guys, this big chicken. I did not change it, nobody changed it. I just came in and sat down and there was a chicken on my screensaver and I don't know how it happened. I don't, I have no idea. I don't even know how to change it. But that happened and I just wanted to remind you guys that every single thing that happens in your life is for a reason. So instead of getting upset or worried or whatever happens when something happens to you or whatever you do when something happens to you, instead stop and think, hmm. Why did this happen? What could it mean? And that is the beginning of how you learn to understand God's signs and find your way the way that God wants you to go. So yeah, find your purpose, find your way, find your path, whatever you want to call it. Stop when God gives you a sign and think, hmm, what could this mean? It's supposed to be a scorching hot day today and it already is 8, 8, 8.30 a.m. and it is scorching. My poor garden is dying for a drink. I need to do that this morning. There's just so many. Penny just got up. Now she's peeing. Are you peeing? Is that what you're doing? I think she's peeing. <laughs> she always stands up and shakes herself up just as we walk down in the morning. Whoa. Gracie's like, we're late! <laughs> oh my goodness, if it's not kids, it's animals. They want you. Just make sure the cat has food. There we go. Cat is full. Horse is about to be fed. I don't know what it is about men, but, and I don't know if it's the same for all of you guys, but a lot of times men forget certain things. Like, he does such a good job taking care of our horses, and I love that. But there are times when he <laughs> forgets things, like he doesn't ever feed the cat. Which is fine, because I'm really mindful of it, and I know that I need to feed, her, feed him. All right, little Minnie. Let's see that nose. Let's see that nose. And Sophie to the rescue. Yeah. So yesterday, Sophie slept at her friend's house. And... When I came back, I was so tired. <laughs> yeah, I could tell she stayed up all night because she... No, only 12. Oh, that's good. And then you were up at 6. Well, 2. And then five, and then, and then six. six. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. So I knew she was extra tired. She came home last night and went straight to bed. And hey, and her Dalmatian missed her so much. <laughs> she won't let her out of her sight. Did you see? She just told her to wait. Sophia is looking for the cat. So Sam had Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday off. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday off. And he doesn't clean up the arena either, so I have to, we have to do that. So every day on the first day that we, of the week that we have to take care of the horses is the busy day. It's the day we have to do all the stuff. It is only 70 degrees in the barn. Like, this barn would be awesome. So I have to cut the grass, water my garden, clean the barn, clean the arena, clean all of it so that it's ready for Sam again tomorrow. I didn't answer. Oh, you didn't take your phone on the trip? Yeah. Oh, I you left it in the car? Me. Did you leave it in the car? Yeah. Oh, that's a good that's a good choice. Good choice making, I Sophie. Carry it around. Yeah, so yesterday Sophie went, where'd you go, Sophie? I forget what it's called. Uh some caves. Yeah. And there's a little forest part thing and it was very pretty. Yeah. My video. Did. And there was a waterfall. And they had seats in between the stairs, so like you could have a break. And <laughs> we used one. So anyway, Sophie took footage. She asked if she could take a camera with her. She went for her on a trip with her friend. And usually we go on trips in the summer, but because of COVID last oh, year. Oh, now I have to bring you there. Yeah, you want to go? We could go. We could definitely go. Ruby's uh, or Molly's like, I can go. Throw me the pylon. Do it. <laughs> Just throw it for me. Woo! Gracie is never the one to have poop stains. And she has a poop stain. <gasps> she has poop on her. 
Gracie. Uh, Gabby's on her way down. She is clearly taking her time. It's the Gabby way of life. She always takes her time. So we're gonna do the horses and I'm gonna show you guys the footage of that Sophie took yesterday. I haven't seen it yet. She's excited to show me though. So I'll show you guys too. You guys can see where she went with her friend Elizabeth. You guys know Elizabeth. She's been in our videos before, right? Yeah, you're only allowed to show the caves part and the crystal part. Okay. Okay, so right now we're walking over to the waterfall. And I don't know how we're gonna get in there, but you know, we're gonna try. So this is across the street from our hike. There's a waterfall over here. Can we get any closer? Yeah, we can get right there and there, see? And we'll be fine. And there's a little bridge over there. And yeah, there's a turtle. It's a snapping turtle. And it's really big. There it is. The green shell. It kind of looks like a dinosaur. Yeah. Okay. So we're at this waterfall. So the oh, waterfall's over there. And then you there's like this rock. And you can dip your oh, feet that's in. Cold. That's cold. <laughs> it's really pretty. I wonder if there's fish here. Okay, this is a really cute bathroom, don't you think? Yeah. It's like in this little... And it's really cute. Okay, we're in the cave. Look, I don't even have to video. It looks wet on the ground, so make sure that you don't slip, okay? Especially for those of you who are wearing socks. Hold on to the bonus there if there is one, okay? See how cool it's getting under the ground? Oh, oh wait, I don't want to be quiet. You can hear the noise of the water. We're in the cave right now. Wait, what way do we go? Wait, can we go in here? We are not going Can we go in there for a second? Yeah, there's a pylon over there. Oh, there is? Okay. No entry beyond this point. Okay, we can't go down there. This is stop number two, and that's what we have to say. If you find this area too area, oh my goodness, I can't see. I'm so tired. Too narrow. Rest of the space is wider as we go. It's like green. It kind of looks like there's like a person thing. Yeah. Mom, how cool that looks down there. Okay, so me and Sophie, Sophie and I got matching crystals. They're a little like different, but, but they're both like these purple crystals, and yeah. they're really pretty. Yeah. Hers is darker and smaller crystals. Mine are, mine's bigger and lighter. Yeah, but we really like our crystals that we got, and we got matching ones because we wanted. Yeah. We were figuring out what matching gift we wanted to get, and this is what we got. It's only fifteen dollars for both of them. No. Don't give him any. He loves it. Oh, never mind. He just won't eat it anymore. Don't give him coffee. Horses drink coffee once, and then they're like, "Ew, no." Good boy, better. Finn. Don't go for it. Don't go for it. No, he wants the whole cup. <laughs> Sophie's first dressage lesson. Hopefully Gabby gets a dressage lesson. I'm not because I'm jumping. I flatted yesterday. We will see what the boss says. Yeah, see, no stormy boy to protect the boss him. Is me. If I don't get to jump, I will do The boss is Fiona. Right, so. Uh, He's yeah. You know? Yeah. Oh, well, hello. Hello, handsome man. How are you? Yeah. So I wanted to tell you guys um, that Brandon has actually been really good about updating me and Storm got something new today. He got, last night I guess, he got new friends. Child, like just the heel goes past the saddle pad. Yeah. So it goes like right there on him. Yeah, the little girl. And can still feel it. Yeah, the little girl that rode him was just a tiny little girl. That's I amazing. I just imagine she knew the lesson kids. Yeah. Like a really slow trot lesson kids. Yeah. 
Chino definitely would not be good. Kids, uh, turn out terrible. Yeah, and Finn could not. So Chino, because he's bouncy, because he is actually a babysitter horse. Is Finn a babysitter horse? No. no. Chin is, he just Finn, doesn't want people getting hurt. Finn. Finn is a jumper. He doesn't like his girl getting hurt no. though. That is for sure. But anyways, we're getting ready. We're waiting for Fiona. I'm gonna take care of Chino's eyes. He literally like, when I say there's a problem, Literally, it means like I noticed a little teeny tiny spot that looked a little tiny like I'm talking I notice everything with my kids. I notice everything with my horse. I like I Always am watching and making sure so so I just have been cleaning his eyes when I come today It doesn't even look like they need to be clean. That's how good they look and then I've just been putting a little bit of cream on there because I want him to not have any like I want everything to be wonderful for him. If you missed yesterday's video, then you might not know that Sophie is doing her very first cross country, no, a venting show. Hey, is that your saddle pad? No. Gabby Lenton? It's in my home, so I don't have any. Oh, because, is it because... Oh, oh it's Oh. So no. And is it because you only like this kind of saddle pad now? Well, you took mine home, and I don't have any other saddle pads. You don't have any saddle pads here? Not here. No saddle pads? No saddle pads. So all those saddle pads are all Gabby's? Yeah. Oh. Mom's crusty trunk. See what I got in here? I got white. I got pink. And I think that's all I have. Okay. What are you do? Those are mine, but don't put those in the locker because I'm not using those. Okay, well I'm gonna put them in the locker so that the next time we come, if you don't have a uh, thing. Plus, I think the white one is the one you need for dressage. So if you don't know what eventing is, which you guys probably all know what eventing is, I'm the only one that doesn't really know that much. I just put my arms in spider webs. But eventing is basically when you do like dressage, jumping, you do, you do dressage and then you do show jumping and then you do cross country, I think, uh, because they have like a big field and jumps in the, in the field and so he's doing 18 inches. Even though she can jump much higher, but she's nervous. She's nervous about like the stuff in the field. So we're gonna see how she does. Um, but I know that Fiona will do her best to make her feel comfortable, and I bet you she loves it after she tries it. Whoo, Sandy today. So you guys know Sophie had her first sleepover. We fly spray while on the horse. And let me tell you, whoo, she's exhausted and miserable. I gotta put a lot on so that I can't get underneath or Want me to do underneath? Yeah. So the girls had really hard lessons. Really hard. I don't know what's wrong with you. She slept. I think she's overtired. Is, is it that you're overtired? I went to bed before everyone else. Last night. I know. But I think she like didn't get enough sleep. Sometimes when I miss a night of sleep, it takes two days for me to catch up. I didn't miss a night of sleep. But you didn't sleep well. He needs a bath. I know. Sophie's lesson was really hard. She worked on, she did a dressage test, you guys. She did her first dressage test. She's like thinking maybe she's gonna love eventing. She doesn't know, she's gonna see. And so, and Gabby's lesson was really hard, you guys. It was, it was really hard. So you guys know I keep telling you that Gabby pulls Chino's head to the inside all the time and she doesn't see it. And so we're trying all these different things to fix it. And she was working on something that was gonna help him really get into a frame and stuff. Like he, 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 wait till you see, like it was a shocking lesson. Like it was hard, but shocking. And the other crazy thing is that next week Fiona's doing a camp and she's gonna do it here. And Gabby and Sophie are gonna be counselors to all the little kids. And I wanna come and be a fly on the wall and watch because Gabby is not a fan of the little kids, but she's always been good with them. All right, we are gonna bath these boys because it has been a sweaty lesson. Super sweaty, super hard. Fly mask for Finn. All right, Finny, what do you think? He's like, is it treats? I think it's great if it's treats. <laughs> it's not treats. I feel like I dreamed this. You dreamed this? Yeah. I like that package. I could use it for little kids. Yeah, that's cute. Fly season is August around our house, the end of July. We started getting them at our house around the end of July. And so we are bringing out the fly masks. I think because we're so far north that our season and our and our bugs and stuff are so different than, than other places. Sylvia, you got it?
All right, so this is the million dollar question. Is Chino gonna roll? Yeah. She rolls later, while she's like dry. That's good, that's a good pony. Gabby says he rolls after he's dried. All right, go see what you can do. He's waiting for Finn. Nope, he's like, see you Finn. Love the color of him wet. gonna have a drink. He's like, that was so hot. It's actually quite breezy, so that's a good thing. Wow, he's really drinking. Here goes Finn. Finny with his blue fly mask. Oh, you look so cute. It's got lots of blue in it. Let's see if Finny rolls. Will Finn roll, Sophie? No, he doesn't like being dirty. I feel like these both horses don't like to be dirty. Tina waited for you. What do you guys think? They book it to the grass field. Tina, let's see if Finny gets a drink. That's it, you already had treats. Go. <laughs> He's like, but what about me? I got nothing else. Uh-oh. It's gonna happen now, they're going. If he rolls, he rolls in the... Oh, oh they both want treats. Oh no, Finn. Oh, he's booking it to the shelter. I don't know. You think he's going to the shelter or you think he's going? Oh, he wants to be accepted into the shelter. Wait, where is he? Or he's scratching. Is he scratching? Yeah. Ah, Finn, don't scratch. All right. It's going to go to hay. Go, Chino. Chino's like, I'll stay here in case they give me treats. Finn's leaving. Finn's going. Finn's going. Where are you going, Finny? He's, he's digging. Um, he's like, no, I guess that's all. Because if they were going to roll, I think they would roll, like, because they know when we come. So I think what Finn would roll, like, tomorrow. Oh, so he wants grass, but he doesn't want to go for it. Chino's going. Oh, no, Chino's going with Finn. Finn's oh, roll. Finn's asking Chino, or... Chino's asking Finn, you coming, Finn? Uh-oh. So there's your clean pony, Sophie. Uh-oh. Don't get stuck by the tree, you silly. You can't crawl over here. That was not a good spot, dude. You know why? He doesn't want to do it in the dirt. Yeah. All the ponies are like, you're wet, rub on me. Oh, see now Finn, Chino's like, come on, let's go for grass. Chino wants to go for grass, I can tell. Yeah, but... But Finn, Finn's being a pokey pony. Sam says Penny doesn't let him catch her. She doesn't. She runs away from him. Look at that. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Watch, she's coming to me, I betcha. She's looking. Did you guys see that? She's coming to me. She's coming to me. Oh, she's waiting. Yep. She's looking though. She's afraid of Sam. He, she ran from him. I know, I didn't believe it either. She doesn't, oh. She never acts like that for me. She doesn't run from him in the morning, he says. What flies you got with you? She's cute. She's such a cutie. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the